was there. <laughs> Just trying to help. Nice jumping, Jack. <laughs> nice sleeping, Lucky. <laughs> Me and I are going to the jungle today. You guys want to come? Sure. Yeah. We're going to see lots of animals. Hey, I know a good animal joke, Mia. Where do cows like to go? Go on Saturday night. You forgot to say that part. Where do cows like to go on Saturday night? Where? To the movies. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Thanks. Come on. Let's go to the jungle. Woo it's kind of muddy there, Jack. Try not to get too dirty. <sighs> okay. Some fun, use our imagination. You can be anyone in any situation. Let's go on an adventure, exploring someplace new. Go near and far together. There's so much we can do. So hey, hey, come out and play. We're going on an adventure today. We're gonna have so much fun. See any lions or tigers or bears today, Eddie? <laughs> Maybe all three. Watch out for the puddle, Jack. I see it, Emma. Huh? <laughs> I think I see a parrot. Really? Where? <laughs> Come on. Uh, I'll help you up. Uh-uh. Okay. by himself? He might get lost. Don't worry, Emma. We'll find him. Come on! This way! <sighs> Just because Emma's my big sister doesn't mean she has to help me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you two sisters? <laughs> <laughs> that looks fun. Cool. I love bananas. I love juggling, too. Wow. Cool trick. Let me try. Whoa! <gasps> uh, thanks. But I didn't really do that on purpose. No, I need a hand, not a banana. <laughs> huh. You two sure are perfect for each other. But I'm not sure I belong here. Thanks for playing with me. <laughs> Look, a banana peel. Jack loves bananas. And he always peels them from the bottom up, just like this one. Good. We're on the right track. Let's hurry. Those monkeys were fun, but 
wow, they never stopped. Emma always stops before things get too wild. Oh, is that a hippo? Hello, I'm Jack, and I'm looking for someone fun to play with. <laughs> Here, come have a snack with me. I kind of like my fish cooked, and I'm not sure how to eat a coconut. It's easy, like this. Hey, me and my sister used to play a fun game with the pineapple. Mama taught me that mouths can do more eating when they do less talking. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Thanks for trying to share your food with me, but I'm not sure I belong here. Bye. Okay. See you later. <sighs> Emma knows what I like to eat. <gasps> Wait for us, Emma! We have to hurry. It's lunchtime. Jack must be hungry. <laughs> Thanks for the apple. You're welcome. Oh, and if you're still hungry, there's plenty more. Mmm. Mom? Dad? This is Jack. I found him in the jungle. I'd like him to be my brother. Isn't he cute? Thanks. This is great. You give me rides, we like the same food, and later, maybe we can play catch together. Cool. Hey, remember the time we played catch with those flamingos? Flamingos? What happened? Pink feathers! They were everywhere! <laughs> and we were sneezing! <laughs> I don't get it. What's so funny? I guess you had to be there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks for saying I could be your brother. But I'm not sure I belong here. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Emma never makes me feel left out. We always laugh about stuff together, just like the elephants. I wish Emma was here. Jack! Ah! Emma! There you are! Here, you must be hungry. And after that, you can have some of this. Howdy, Jack. <gasps> it's Pineapple Pete. Pineapple Pete is always sweet. <laughs> uh, what's so funny about a pineapple that's sweet? Oh, it's a sister-brother thing. I'm sorry I left without telling you, Emma. Sometimes I wish you wouldn't help so much. Okay, I get it. I'll try not to help unless you ask me to. You've got a deal, big sister. A sister is someone you can count on. Amazing! Jack saw lots of animals. 
really close up. <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. Were they friendly animals? Everyone is friendly in the jungle. Even the pineapples. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys want to play catch? Okay. I sure. do. Yeah. Uh, huh? Whoa! <clears throat> Jack, let me show you the right way to catch up. <gasps> Sorry. Do you want me to show you? Not this time. I'd like to figure it out for myself. But thanks. Now let's play! All right! <laughs> okay, in this race, you hop to the tree on one leg, then hop back on the other leg. On your mark, get set, go! <laughs> a butterfly? Yes, and it flew right in front of me or I would have won. Uh, I don't see it, Tessa. Are you sure there was a butterfly? Tessa never lies, Eddie. She would have won if it wasn't for that zigzaggy butterfly. Okay, if you say so. What kind of race should we do next? Oh, how about a snow saucer race? Snow saucer? But there's no snow. There isn't. Snow Globia. Great idea. Let's go. I love Snow Globia. Hey, hey, come out and play. We're going on an adventure today. We're gonna have some fun. Use our imagination. You can be anyone in any situation. Should we play a little trick on him? <laughs> hey, where'd the snow saucer go? <laughs> oh, it's a, a... a snow creature! Roar! Roar! Cool! Hey, guys! Come look at this! <laughs> A big snow creature, and it took our snow saucer. Hmm. Maybe you just couldn't find it. Uh, no, no. The creature took it. Scientific fact: No one has ever seen a real, live snow creature. Are you sure you saw it? Well, no, I didn't really see the creature, but I saw its shadow. It was all like, ah, I'm a snow creature. Ah! Well, that old snow creature can't just take our snow saucer. Come on, let's get it back. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Yes! Hey, everybody! I found it! Stay! I found the snow creature! It's right here! Haha, <laughs> yes! Good one, my friend. Well, it was right there. Maybe it's behind the snowbank. Huh? Eddie, 
I know you feel bad about losing the snow saucer, but we all lose stuff sometimes. So maybe because you feel bad, you just think that a snow creature took our saucer. I didn't make it up! It's real! We have to keep looking! <sighs> we don't really have to find the snow saucer right now. We could build an igloo or make a snowman. No, Tessa. When we find the saucer, we'll find the creature. What if there is no creature, Mia? Eddie says there is, so it must be true. <laughs> roar, roar, roar. I hear it. It must be here. <gasps> Footprints. Roar. Guys, hurry, hurry, it's in the tree. <laughs> And there are footprints, right? No, they were here, I promise. It doesn't matter, Eddie. We don't need to find the saucer right now. We can go ice skating instead. You can go skate if you want to. I'm gonna keep looking. Great, let's go. Are you sure you don't want to come with us, Eddie? <sighs> no, thanks. Okay, bye guys. Aren't you going, Mia? Nope, we have a snow creature to find. Thanks for believing me, Mia. You never lie, Eddie, so you must have seen it. Maybe it's inside that big log. Ooh. <laughs> <gasps> <gasps> Mia, the snow creature! Huh? Ugh, never mind. I want to blame you if you never believe me again in a gazillion years. But I do believe you, Eddie. Cause look what I found in the log. I think the snow creature's been eating bananas. Hey, maybe we can get it to come to us. Come on. <laughs> Eddie, it wasn't a snow creature that took our saucer. It was snow monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> they were just playing a trick on me. Now, let's play a trick on them. Creature does not take our banana snowman while we go ice skating. Mmm, more bananas. <laughs> Surprise! <gasps> you got us. <laughs> Snow monkeys? What's going on? Hi, guys. Meet Eddie's snow creature. Huh? Uh -huh. These snow monkeys were playing a joke on Eddie. They pretended they were a snow creature and took the snow saucer. Pretty funny, right? So Eddie played a joke back on them, pretending to be a snowman. <laughs> he got us good, too. Wow. Well, sorry we didn't believe you, Eddie. Yeah, sorry. Thanks, guys. And thank you, Mia, for believing in me and helping me solve this mystery. You're welcome. When a friend tells you something that is true, but you say it cannot be. Remember, being a good friend means taking time to see. A friend is like the shining sun. We feel their warmth and light. When we believe and trust each other, things turn out just right. We're friends, believing in friends. Trusting 
being your friends is not the nicest way to act. A friend will always be there and be kind and sweet and true. So believe and trust your friends, cause they believe in trusting you. We're friends, believing in friends, each and every day. True friends forever. Racing was a great idea, Sophie. Really great. So fun. What an adventure. Thanks. We're really sorry we didn't believe you about the snow creature, Eddie. It's okay. And now I know what it feels like when someone doesn't believe you. I'm sorry I didn't believe you about the butterfly during the race, Tessa. Thanks, Eddie. But there's no butterfly in my way now. Race it to the tree and back. You're on. We may be little, but our show is big. Play that music, it's a super gig. Our stories take us anywhere together. Out to sea.